The spotlight this morning, former Central Falls police officer Derek Lavasser became a fan favorite during his time on the show Big Brother. Since that big win, though, he's gone on to write a book, host shows and a podcast. And now he has a new show with none other than Nancy Grace. And he's here to talk about it all this morning. Welcome back. It's been a while. You're about the busiest <laughs> guy I know. Uh, and okay. I had to get Nancy Grace on the show first well before I could even get you. You hit me up in the DMs. You tagged me and I, then I felt <laughs> I guilty. And I'm like, OK, I'm coming on. I was like, so on. when are you coming on the show? Because I know you're busy, but Nancy Grace time for me so you big brothered me I did I thought really maybe did. I could be on big brother you absolutely could I was like wow she had Nancy on before me that's not a good look <laughs> it's not good so we got here. you here yes. we got you here but how exciting to be doing a national show with Nancy Grace I yep. mean how did this happen let's start there Oh God, it's a long, it's a long story. But you know how the TV thing goes. I mean, listen, Nancy was doing a new show. She had just signed up with Discovery ID. They wanted to do a show that was covering covering relevant cases, mm. the new developments in those cases. They were looking for a detective's perspective mm -hmm. on it. I'd worked with Nancy before, and uh, luckily enough, I got the opportunity to work with her again. It's been great. It's been great, and it's also great to have other experts on the show because, yeah. as an investigator myself, I'm learning from them every week. Yeah, it's a little bit different than um, you've done shows before. This is yeah. not your first show yeah. I'm I've watched them all because I'm a you know true crime kind of TV show junkie plus obviously a friend of yours so I've watched your shows they're all very well done you've worked with investigation discovery before mm. where this show also is so how is this show different than the shows you've done in the past well this show is more like this show here which mm. I don't know how you guys do this <laughs> this is like so unnerving to me but it's a talk show every week like I said we're at a table kind of like this and we're covering a lot of the cases you've heard of before mm -hmm. But when there's new developments in it, we want to break them down from a different perspective. So, for example, we're talking about Gilgo Beach right now, mm -hmm. but not necessarily from the angle of the alleged killer, Rex mm. Superman, more so from the wife. Was she involved? Does she know about it? There's new developments in that case, so we break that all down. I could talk about this for hours. I just watched a show on Gilgo Beach it's, the other night, yeah. and that if you're not familiar with it, I would, an, yeah, I would say to definitely watch I, your I show most, because it is incredibly intriguing mm, absolutely it's uh there's a lot to it a lot of wrinkles to it so we break that down and it's allowed me opportunities to work on other things and, mm -hmm. to, and to kind of expand that and, and use what the platform that i have now to try to solve other cases that maybe you haven't heard of yeah let's talk about that because i heard you did just solve a pretty big case yeah and it was a team effort right so uh we have this new coffee company criminal coffee it's a true crime themed coffee we're based right here in rhode island mm -hmm. and uh, we're selling locally as well and uh, basically we donate a portion of the proceeds to solving cold cases. So we just funded our first case mm -hmm. through the DNA testing. 60-year-old mm -hmm. case, Jane Doe case, they didn't know who she was. Come to find out after the DNA testing, the reason they never solved it, it was a male. It wasn't a female. We ultimately solved it. Will you know literally Will on the set just audibly yeah. went, oh, yeah. I don't know if you could hear that if yeah. our mics picked it up, but that's incredible. Yeah. So, so again, I wanted to do something, give back to the community that I've worked in for so long. This is an opportunity to do it. And by the way, Will, you're going to like this yeah. one. <laughs> discount right now, 10% off. On, you can use the code The Roadshow. Get your discount. If you're in Rhode Island, we'll deliver it to you locally. Perfect. Happy holidays. Yeah. So you are, I mean, everyone is familiar with you, I would imagine by now. But, you know, you're a local guy. You, you still are local, yeah. even though yeah. you're traveling all over the Built country right here. for all of your, you know, different shows. But it's, it's always been so important to you to kind of give back to Rhode Island, Central Falls, the whole community that kind of, you know, brought you up. Absolutely. Ever since Big Brother, the support that I've received is has been exponentially important to my success. And like you were just saying, I could move on to different places, go do the Hollywood thing, but I just built a studio right here in Rhode Island. We have a podcast, mm -hmm. Crime Weekly. We just passed 60 million downloads. And I wanted to really put down some roots and hopefully expand that role and, and do new podcasts mm. from people here in Rhode Island, other law enforcement officers that want to get involved. So the studio is literally five minutes from here. We got a lot of uh, plans for the future and I, I'm hoping to expand the amount of, I guess, market share we have mm. with podcasting with people from Rhode Island. Which is so great because again, everyone here loves you so much and we we're saying, you know, Rhode Island's kind of the center of the universe, Cranston specifically, mm. but there's, you know, so many connections out there in the world. So thank you so much for coming back. Back and back. you know, you getting me, us updated. Yeah. A little bit. I, I could talk to you for a long time about all of your projects, but thank you for taking the five minutes today, I love it. Derek. I love it. For me, anytime and I tricked you into it. <laughs> <Anytime>. <laughs> you can catch Derek weekly on Crime Feed, airing on Investigation Discovery.